Yeah! Happy New Year! Let's see there for this year that we don't get fucked off. What? Oh, 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 yeah! All right. Like me pie? Gorgeous. Yep, beautiful. Right. This video, I have no idea what I'm going to say. But I know it'll be good, and I know you'll laugh. And if you've made it through and you're listening to this video, good on you. Congratulations, you got through a year. Right? That's what we want. So, this year, what I'm going to say to everybody is this. I just want to make something clear, though. Right? To all of those out there that might be suffering, and for whatever reason, right? I have not seen a medical practitioner for my drug use or my depression, whatever you want to call it, nothing. I just put down the drugs and just sort it out. And I'm understanding that not everyone can do that, right? It can be very hard. You need to talk to people. I'm not saying not to, right? I'm not saying that I don't need to, right? But what I've found is doing this channel, right, talking to all of you, is helping me greatly and the comments and I will say this in all the comments I don't know about other youtubers and stuff like that but I do read the comments and I have not come across one slur or one smart ass comment in regards to being just a dick all right they've all been very positive I've listened to a lot of people's stories that have followed my channel and are now telling me about their life and I've read their comments for a long time and it's taken a bit of time for them to tell me what they're going through and stuff as I've been trying to tell you all and for those people who might be a worrier to understand it takes time for a sufferer to fully tell you what's going on right and you know I just want to say you know this is a we all say happy new year it's a cliche thing right but really it's another day right but it is the start of the year right and if you're all still here regardless last night on your own sad whatever you've gotten through it right mary and i were apart last night i wasn't with mary right i had some matters to attend to right and that for a friend who was in need okay that's all i'll say there right um and I had I went to sleep last night at about nine o'clock watching the Avengers. Right. So, but um I just want to say that this year, right, or not this year, just you know, what I'm planning on doing is this, right? We're going to do a transformation, right? Okay, so this is how it's gonna go, right? And that was from uh, Steve, behind the bars. We went to his place for Christmas and he bought me a pie, right? So the transformation is gonna be one of something that I know how to do, right? I did it on my own when I did bodybuilding, right? But I didn't go to do bodybuilding. Let me make that quite clear. I went to the gym, right, to keep my demons at bay. And I wasn't even suffering, but I was in a bit of a bad relationship and that for many years and that, but I kept it all under control and, you know, just worked. And then as going to the gym, you know, um, I noticed that, you know, I was, you know, looking pretty good. Obviously I won a trophy in it. So what we're gonna do this year, what I endeavor to do with Mary, to inspire Mary, right, is I'm going to get back on the uh, on the gym thing, right? Ah, we're going to transform this this body. How's that, right? This weedy little body, right? Okay, with me little legs and that, right? And then we're going to tighten up the old cushy, right? Okay, all right. So, this is how you see me now, on the 1st of January, Happy New Year, right? And hopefully in around about three months, right, I 
I'll show you again. It's not gonna be a week by week thing. You don't do it like that, because if you do, you won't see any change. And I'll tell you this, about that. That's how you take on your crisis in your life. You don't check it every day. You don't check it every week, right? You just make a goal, right? Then you get there. Because if you check yourself to get to the goal every week, you're not gonna see changes. And along that time, you're gonna have pitfalls, right? But you've set a goal. So you can have your pitfalls in the middle or on the way there, and then you just work a bit harder after them because you've set a goal in yourself. I'm setting it on YouTube, right? So in three months, right? Okay, when's that? March. <laughs> March, in March, right? Okay, January. I'll be undressing February. again. April, say April. Say April, yeah. right. I'll be undressing again on camera, and hopefully this, ready, ready? <laughs> Won't be there, it's not there anyway, I'll just fix it out. Okay, but this will be all transformed, right? Not bigger, but just a little bit fitter, you know, less wobbly, right? Than that. More, 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 more tone. Okay, right. But I've listened to all the comments and a couple of comments I just want to make. I will be talking about a few things. And that now is everybody's doing it hard at the moment. Queensland, luckily they're Queenslanders. They know how to swim. They're underwater at the moment. Right, then you've got Perth, it's burning, right? But you've just got to, for a purpose, as I said in one video, I said you've got to find a purpose, right? Don't, and this is for the warriors in regards to the, uh, talking to the, the, the you know, the, 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 the sufferers, right? You can't show or tell the sufferers a purpose. You've got to give them broadness, right? And give them ideas for a purpose, okay? And that, that's what you do. Because if you try and narrow them down to, to something, right, you're limiting other areas they might be at, might want to go. So you're stressing them out more. And also for the sufferers, you need to reiterate to that too, back to the warriors. So you understand each other, right? As for the not getting back, right, the three days thing, if you're curled up in a ball in the fetal position and you're suffering, right, and that... At least send a text. Don't tell them you're okay, because you're not okay, right? Just say, I'm, I'm still here, right? And they'll get it, right? You've acknowledged it, so just send them, I'm still here, right? Thank you, okay? And as the warriors, accept that. And when you see them, don't tell them you're called, don't, tell, don't carry on in a tiz and stuff like that as much as you want to. Just simply be calm and say, how are you? What, what happened? You know, explain it to them. So then they might be able to see the trigger points, right, that might be setting you on a road. We're all, but regardless of mental health or, you know, male, female, it doesn't matter. You're all, there's going to be a, a downturn in life, a, a pitfalls, regardless, and nothing to do with mental health. And you just got to learn to soldier on, right? Okay? And, you know, think of it as this. The old saying goes, Right? If it bucks you off, what are you going to do? You've got to get back on that horse and you've got to ride it. Okay? So keep riding. That's my message for today. Keep riding that broncoing horse. All right? It'll be a fun bounce and a sore bum at the end, but you'll reap the virtues at the end. Go get a pie!